Before we start, I want you to watch and hear this question carefully. The outer core is in liquid state while the inner core is in solid state. Why? I mean the inner core is hotter than the outer core, but the inner core is solid and the outer core is a liquid. Why? Why is it like that? Well, this question is part of geophysics. A geophysicist is someone who studies the Earth using gravity, magnetic, electrical and seismic methods. So going back to the question, we know that Earth's inner core and outer core are both made up of iron nickel alloy and that's why the core is also called as the knife layer where the Ni stands for nickel and Fe stands for iron. And we also know that matter can exist in one of three main states that is solid, liquid or gas. And for that we need the right temperature and pressure conditions. Now if I have to give you an example, solid can be transformed into a gas by the process of sublimation, for example burning of camphor. Similarly, gas can be converted into solid. A good example for this can be a fire extinguisher which has been filled with gaseous carbon dioxide but inside the canister the high pressure causes this to turn into solid carbon dioxide which later is released as a white powder when putting out a fire. In both the examples, temperature and pressure played an important role. Therefore, with right temperature and pressure conditions, a matter can exist in solid, liquid or gas state. Now most materials including iron and nickel change from liquid to solid at low temperatures or high pressures. It's easy to understand going from a solid to a liquid at higher temperatures because we are all familiar with ice melting on a warm day. But why do materials change from liquid to solid at higher pressure? For almost all materials except water, atoms are packed close together in the solid state than in the liquid state. So when you squeeze the atoms together with high pressure, the material changes from liquid to solid. Now when you understand this, now think about this, as you go deeper in the earth, both temperature and pressure increases. Although the inner core is very hot, it is solid because it is experiencing very high pressure. The pressure is so great that the metals are squeezed together to not be a liquid. The pressure in the outer core is not high enough to make it solid. And this is why the outer core is in liquid state while the inner core is in solid state, despite of the fact that the inner core is hotter than the outer core. If you want to see more of such educational content, make sure you're subscribed. By doing so, you'll get an alert when my next video comes. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.